Hi there! This video will show you how to design on a cake box die line template. While adding your design to the die line template, it can be helpful to refer back to the cake box orientation guide to see how you should place your design elements. To show you how to add your design to a cake box die line template, let's use this PacMojo box as a base and add some additional elements. As you can see, this box has logo and text elements on several panels. Cake boxes are made using one flat paperboard which is folded during assembly. For cake boxes, you have the option of designs on the exterior and interior, but the interior is often left blank. For the exterior, designs on the front, front flaps, and top lid remain in the same orientation. Designs that will be on the back, back flaps and bottom should be inverted. Designs on the right wall and left flap should be rotated 90 degrees clockwise and designs on the left wall and right flap should be rotated 90 degrees anti-clockwise. The interior is often left blank. However, if you choose to add designs to the interior, designs on the lid, back, back flaps, and bottom stay in the same orientation, whereas designs on the front and front flaps are inverted. Designs on the right flap and left wall are rotated 90 degrees anti-clockwise, and designs on the left flap and right wall are rotated 90 degrees clockwise. When you're done designing, double check it with the die line orientation guide to make sure that everything is in the correct location and orientation. To learn more about adding logos, vectorizing text, or embedding images, click on the link in the description or head to our website for more design tips. Happy designing!